Well, one of the actors, Graham, um, he was in the last audition with four of our housemates. So they've actually seen him in auditions. So we planted little seeds like that to make them believe that this is actually happening. It seems that Dean has had enough of Graham's overbearing nature. A bit more flour and water, mate. That's a bit sticky. Oh, Graham, get out of my face. It's, Seriously. That's stick, Dean, that's sticky. Mate. It's bread. Hey, come on, Nada. What do you guys like you always get picking in the kitchen? Oh, guys like me. Here we go. You know what? You do it. You know, I, I sort of pile on in my own little way and I, I'm who I am and what you see is what you get. And I've got a fairly strong outgoing personality, but um, no, I like to, you know, involve people and I like to get involved. But I think people maybe, I don't know, think I'm taking over them. It seems that Dean has had enough of Graham's overbearing nature. <laughs> it's sticky. Oh, Graham, get out of my face. Seriously. It's stick, Dean, it's sticky. Mate. It's bread. Hey, come on, Nella. What do guys like you always get picking in the kitchen? Oh, guys like me. Here we go. You know what? Here, you do it. You know, I, I sort of pile on in my own little way and I, I'm who I am and what you see is what you get. And I've got a fairly strong outgoing personality, but um, no, I like to, you know, involve people and I like to get involved. But I think people maybe, I don't know, think I'm taking over them a bit. I don't think there's anything I wouldn't do. I see myself as a leader, for sure. Definitely not a follower, definitely not negative. Positive leader. Well, that's one of the things with survival. If you're somewhere and you've got nothing to eat, you'll eat your mates. If your mate's dead, you'll eat him. Actually, my name's Graham, but my, my actually call me G. Yeah, G. Ah, oh, all right. I Just like one it, it's snappy. <laughs>
We will be leaving very shortly. I'm going in there to win for me, for the team, get the food, win the third time. And anyway, if I'm given a challenge, I, I'm going to overcome it. Get me out of here. I don't care about any. Why you leave? Okay, I'm oh, sorry to get me out of here. I can't do All right, this. Alright, we'll bring in the Rangers. We'll get you out of there. Give me some more bugs. I'm lonely in here. That's crickets that have joined you in there now. I don't want to come out till it's finished. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, the bugs. Yes, here comes number five. Give me some bugs. Bring it on. Right, Graham, that's it. We're going to get you out now. We'll bring oh. in the Rangers. Three today, four to be tomorrow. How are you Lovely. feeling, Graham? Lovely. Wow. Very tasty. <laughs> Graham, you really smashed that one. Let's we'll start with Terry first. What happened in there for you? I, the bugs fell in my mouth to start with because I didn't expect them to fall out. And I got confused. And then they started biting me. And then I also like, had all these things about what else could come out. Okay, of. Graham, you got five stars. That means a meals for camp tonight. Well done. You guys are going to be very happy. Off you go, guys. <laughs> and uh, we'll see you soon. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> Some protein there, Graham. All oh, right, bye, guys. Bye. Oh. That was just the worst ever. I really wanted to beat Graham, and like, if I had to stay brave, I should have. We haven't eaten. This is going to be like day three, and we haven't eaten anything. The good news was that Terry caught in there and virtually gave me straight away. I could have only got one or two, get beans on toast, but I got the five. That's perfect. You know. Commiserations. That is incorrect. It is Berlin. Oh! 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 So Graham had lost the challenge. He was gutted, and you know, at times like this, it would have been so easy for Graham's teammates to turn on him and kick him when he was down. So they did. <laughs> oh, we all had the theory that he th he threw the game. That he somehow he's up to some sort of mystery. To be fair, that uh, Julia is starting to break down a bit. No food and. Wet and young, 21. I don't seriously lose to the other team any day. Back to the trial now. I'm trapped in a cage. Pamela was about to face some very difficult questions. The first one being, how come you've turned into a man? Up, Pamela. We'll get you up and we'll start counting your stars. Was there a lot of room when you went down or what was it? Oh, it was going right down. If I didn't, you know, answer all the questions, it would have kept going and going. What questions? Were they co uh, general knowledge, were they? Just give you a asked chance the questions to speak. Just give them. a chance to speak, oh. Graham. No. No, I'll tell you later. Yeah. No, Please, I'm right. sorry. That's cool. Yes, I'm that's not going to... Cool. No, cool. I'm not going to be yeah. spoiled. My challenge by you, Graham, sorry. So you got six questions no. right, obviously. Graham, then. Graham! Um, leave her alone. We don't want to talk about it, Pamela. We won't talk about it. It's a nice one, Graham. Upsetting everyone again. I hope you feel good for that. You're having a go at me for asking her what oh, questions Graham, did he ask you today? You're seriously, you're really making her upset. <laughs> We're very happy. We're very happy. Yeah. Oh, no, you're doing a great You are so, so proud. <laughs> It just, you know, it just makes everything difficult, bloody difficult. It's all a bit of an overreaction, wasn't it? She, and the thing is, she didn't even do the trial. That Australian bloke stood in and done it. <laughs> well done, Pamela, though. Well, he well it, loose, it, loosely it, speaking. <laughs> six stars, six meals for camp. But well, once again, tough times for Graham in there. <laughs> yeah. I know Graham. And I know that he is capable of having a regular conversation on a normal level if he so chooses. So, Graham's worried about the official secret act. If you want to ring the military police, then the number to call is 0113 496 0000 and add 07 for Graham. Lines close later on, calls after that time won't be counted. But Graham, hopefully, will be charged. Uh, back to yesterday now, when the group were prepared to face their biggest challenge so far. So far? <laughs> Celebrities, you will shortly be making your way out of camp for the overnight challenge to win immunity. Ready? See you guys, see you there. I'm feeling confident, pumped, and we're gonna win it. We are there. It's a foregone conclusion. We're going for it. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> We've just arrived and there are like coffin-like beds. I'm really worried right now. Um, my stomach is like turning. Celebrities, 
You won't be spending tonight in camp. You will spend it here in one of these beds. The aim of the game is to stay in your bed as long as possible. You won't be alone in your bed for long. You will each be joined by a bed bug. The bed bugs joining individual team members will be decided by the other team. You can decide which bed bug each of them will face. Good luck and sleep well. Okay. Wow. Oh God, I swear if they give me soldier crabs, I'm jumping out. I can't do that. Graham, I'm scared. You've got crabs, Julia, but they're harmless. Oh, my God, I hate crabs. They haven't even got any snippers on them. I got a lot of support from Graham today, and I really appreciated that support because I wouldn't have gone through the whole ordeal without him. That's my tash, uh, Skippy. Not one of your mates. I know you might look like one of your mates, but it's my... my tash. Good, you're good. Oh, there's so many of them. You're good. The Dumbo shirt. Yeah, they're, everyone's got oh, everything no, no, everywhere. No. I don't think so. Okay, you're hey. the only one that's in these boxes. That's. Come on, oh, hey. Fuck off, Jen. Stop getting crabby. Hey, yo, Terry, you suck. I don't like Jen or Billy. I think they're backstabbing. I think they're conniving. What an absolute twat that woman is. I hate the woman. What a thoroughly unpleasant evening. Horrible. Celebrities, congratulations on surviving your nights with the bed bugs. The results will now be revealed on the clocks. Come on. The orange team were revealed to have a time of 15.18 and the blue team, go the blue team, had a total of 17.28, which meant that we did not have to face elimination, which was brilliant. Yes. Well done, guys. Thank you. Go the blues. Well done, guys. So thanks to that challenge, half the group are immune, but for the others, the phone lines are now open for the very first time. Here, let's go in and give them the result of your votes. Here we go. Right, we're here. Uh, because the for the first time, the public have been voting for the celebrities they want to keep in camp. Ben, Dave, Graham, Pamela and Julia, you are all immune. Congratulations. Uh, the person with the fewest votes will leave today. The public have decided the first person they want to leave, I'm a celebrity, is... Oh. Billy. Oh. Billy, get yourself ready. ready. We'll see you across the bridges in a few minutes' time. See you, everyone. Oh, see you, everyone. Oh, How are you? Come, on, Come on, grab a seat. Grab a seat. Oh. It was a madhouse, wasn't it? There was one person in the group who united the entire camp against him right from the beginning. See, I if, think, you, see if you can guess who we're talking, we're talking about. about. <laughs> yeah, Graham. Yeah, you guessed it was Graham. He was just unrelenting. You could say anything. You'd call him an idiot. You could tell him you loved him, but yeah. he was going home the same guy. And none of us have ever met someone so relentless, someone just so oblivious to the things going on. Do you think he knew? what he was doing. Oh, was he you know, aware of the effect he was having? I went through all these weird emotions. I thought he might have been this savant great actor who's just been playing this role the whole time. And I think as it went on, I just realised he's a bit of a lunatic. So by the end, I loved him. I enjoyed him. Yeah. I loved just prodding him. And Oh, yeah, Graham, that sounds right to me, my having friend. Having fun with him. Yeah, because oh, you, there was no way you were ever changing that man. Yeah. He is a uh, true bred luno. <laughs> now, In the nicest way. We're out of time here, uh, but Laura, Joe and Russell are waiting for you nice to be too with Get Me Out of Here Now. And we'll be back tomorrow night at 8.30. All that's left for us to say now, though, is Billy, you're a celebrity. Get yourself out of here. Billy, everybody. Yeah. Well done, pal. Off you go, Billy. Hey, well done, man.